Hello, hello, hello everyone. How are you? Hope you're having a fantastic, fantastic day and may peace be upon you. Thank you, thank you, thank you for watching this video. If you are catching me live, comment one. If you are catching me on the replay, comment two. If you are new to me, comment three so that I can reach out and say hello. So today I'm going to be sharing with you my top tips on the easiest and simplest way to be featured on the media. Remember to comment where you're catching me from. I'd love to know. If we haven't been properly introduced before, my name is Dr. Izdihar Jamil. I'm an entrepreneur. I'm also a number one international best-selling author of the book, Yes, I can. If you haven't already grabbed a, a copy, go and grab a copy from Amazon because it's going to be super valuable to you. And I've also been really blessed. I've been featured in hundreds and hundreds and hundreds of media all around the world. So darlings, are you ready? And how many of you here would absolutely love, 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 love to be featured in the media? Give me a yes. Thank you. And also let me know which media that you actually, um, that are part of your goals that you're wanting to be featured in. Now, quick tips, like you got to understand, like what is the purpose of you wanting to get in the media? Like, so one of the really, really cool stuff when you get into the media is that you will be endorsed by a highly recognized brand as an expert in your field. Can you imagine that? How cool would that be if you have NBC or ABC or Vibe or any, any top media publication endorse you as an expert? And as a result, you're able to tap into the network of thousands and thousands of people. Do you think that it will help to grow your business or attract the right clients for you? Give me a yes. If you feel that so. Okay, then let's kind of like bring it in to like the easiest and simplest way you can get into the media. Understand this about the media. The media is always, always, always looking for content. What are they looking for, darlings? Content. Common content. Thank you. They're always, always, always looking for content to feed its audience. That's what its audience wants, right? They want to be able to, to consume um, particular content that's going to be beneficial to them, that they're wanting to read about. So content. So all you have to figure out is what content that is the right fit for that media, for the audience. That's really simple. It's like really boiling down to that content content like what content can add value what content can add value to the media's audience okay darling common content okay and the key word next to it is value so comment value it's not about remember the media is not about you when you going for the media it's not about you it's about content that gives value to its audience it's as simple as that okay does it make sense? If this makes sense, comment yes. While I still remember, if you're wanting to know what kind of content is a good fit for media, or which media can you get into, or what kind of um, pitch that you're going to be getting into, I've got the link above here and the link below here after this video. So come and join me because I'm offering my course the fast authority accelerator and that course was being announced by nbc abc fox cbs as one of the top life-changing um courses so the fast authority accelerator i'm going to be teaching i'm going to be teaching you how you can get into the media what are the media looking for and how you can you know get high profile publicity from simple simple one easy simple method so come and join me okay link above here and the link below here so we know the media wants content that is of value that's going to add value to its audience okay that's where they're going to say yes to you now the other parts of the media the easiest and simplest way you know they're wanting content the second part is that you gotta pitch to them 
Because if you're not pitching, if you're not putting yourself forward, how are they going to see you? Makes sense, right? So the way to do it is to have what I call the perfect pitch. The perfect pitch. Darling, comment the perfect pitch. Thank you. So for me, the perfect pitch, I've already created that for you. It's really as simple as fill in the blanks. It can't get any simpler than that. It's highly converting. It's what I personally use to get featured on different kinds of media. It's what I teach my clients to use to get featured on different kinds of media. The perfect pitch. Darling's comment, the perfect pitch. If you're wondering what constitutes of a perfect pitch, what is it content, what does it look like, how can you get hold of it, come and join me in my free course, The Fast Authority Accelerator, and then I'll kind of break it down for you. I'll give you the steps and the info that you need to build or to kind of fill in the blanks with your perfect pitch. So The Fast Authority Accelerator, click on the link above here and the link below here and come and join me, okay? So the first content that is of value. Second, the perfect pitch. The third, um, you got to be consistent with it. That's it. You got to be consistent with pitching. Now, in order for you to be consistent with pitching, you got to know who to pitch to, right? So that's another kind of little puzzle that I'm going to be exploring in my course and could be sharing with you in the Fast Authority Accelerator. So click on the link above or the link below to come and join me. It's a free course. The Fast Authority Accelerator is a high-profile course. It's been endorsed and being announced in NBC, Fox, um, uh, CBS, and all the, the, the amazing media all around the world. So come and join me if you want to know the easiest and simplest way to get in the media. So let's wrap up content that adds value. So darlings comment content that adds value. So put yourself out of the equation for a minute, figure out what is the content that's going to add value to your audience. Got it? Does this make sense? Give me a yes if this makes sense. Thank you. And then the second part is the perfect pitch. You've got to have a perfect pitch because otherwise you couldn't go be flying in blind and wouldn't know what to say, wouldn't know what to do, or is it going to be too long, it's going to be too short, it's not going to be enough. So I have created the perfect pitch template that's as easy as fill in the blanks. So how awesome is that? So you're more than welcome to come up with your own perfect pitch template but if you kind of want to leverage and kind of like um jump in into my perfect pitch click on the link above and the link below because i'm going to be sharing more of that in my course the fast authority accelerator so there you go darling if you have this method if you have this formula it's as easy as abc in getting featured on those media like I'm, I'm like, I'm just like you. I'm not a journalist. I'm not an editor. I'm not a writer. You know, I'm actually a computer scientist, but I've like figured it out. I've cracked the code on how everyday people like you and me can be the top authority by leveraging in the media. As a result, build trust, credibility, the know, like, love and trust factor with our audience and get them across the line and convert them so that we can help them and we're blessed with their money. So come and join me at the Fast Authority Accelerator happening really soon. Click on the link above and the link below if you want to find out more about getting into the media or booking speaking gigs or getting into a Forbes or entrepreneur or TED. Okay, I'll see you then. Take care. May peace be upon you. Bye. Bye-bye-bye.